Let's take a look at the tail of the tape. 22 for Derek Evans. 167 to 165. Nothing much there. And the records mark pretty much even. Absolutely. Uh, 21 for Tyner and Derek Evans, who has a loud cheering section to hear from Utica, New York. So uh, get ready for this third bout. And you can feel the power, the presence of the fans of Derek Evans right now. Let's go up for the official introduction. Here's Joe Antonacci. All right, boxing fans, here we go. Four rounds of action in the super middleweight division. Our judges, Don Ackerman, Winkin, and Tom Shrek, and our referee, Charlie Fitch. Introducing first in the red corner. He comes to us tonight from Albany, New York. He weighed in at 165 pounds, blue trunks, white trim. Professional record, one victory, one defeat, and one knockout. Please welcome Steve Too Sharp Tyner. And his opponent, fighting out of the blue corner. He comes to us tonight from Utica, New York. He weighed in at 167 pounds. Red trunks and black trim. Tonight, he is making his professional debut, Derek Superbad Evans. Referee Charlie Fitch has our fighter's final instructions. Good evening, gentlemen. You both know the rules. Protect yourself and obey my commands at all times. Clutch closed now. Come on, fighting at the bell. Four rounds. Super middleweight. Derek Evans, he's well, got it all. The last time I heard an ovation that loud was when Stephanie walked into the club last <laughs> week when I was hanging out with her. And Derek Evans in the red, Steve Tyner in the blue. And look out for that right hand of Derek Evans. Although that left wasn't bad, but he's trying to time him with that right. Evans told me he was excited about this third day of view, but he's excited. What makes these, what are these fans? These are ecstatic. He said he's got a lot of friends and family here tonight. You can definitely hear it in the crowd. It was definitely they introduced him into the ring. Th these guys actually fought as amateurs. Um, Evans won, so, and he said that really doesn't matter, so. Oh, and a big shot. There it is, the punch he was looking for. And Tynan 
taking the eight count. The referee makes him walk to him. He'll let it go. Will we see another right hand? A left on him. Tyner standing up. Will that chin hold up? Left, right. It's all Derek Evans with the crowd cheering him in. Now, Evans can't make the mistake of punching himself out, Mark. He's got to save something. Oh, another right hand. That this is, is it. it. A one round knockout for Derek Evans. And this crowd is going ballistic. Terrific performance. The, uh, the crowd going crazy here before the fight. And Derek Evans more than lived up to the billing. Half of the audience right now is on their feet. What a victory for Derek Evans before thousands of his hometown fans. As the doctor checking out Steve Tyner on the school in just a minute. But tonight's fights would not be possible without the heavy-duty support of our heavy-hauling friends at Rosselli Trucking, led by Joe and Rich Rosselli. We have, uh, at uh, Turning Stone, enjoyed years of service and support from Rosselli Trucking, and pro boxing here would not be possible without their support. Mike, the best in the I business, think, uh, Rosselli Trucking. Also, special we thanks to Ori Vestillo from the uh, beaches of Rome for their ongoing partnership. 100 years of hospitality experience. The beaches of Rome are like family. Taste the bite of the very history of the world, the finest in family dining. Also, I think the fans here in upstate New York have a new hero. Let's take a look at some of that action. That left caught him. You see, it's an overwhelming offense. There's a right, another right. Right there, uh, Tyner's hurt. You know he's standing. You can see he's kind of leaning over a big right hand there, and bang, with the hard right. We said at the start that that right hand was his Sunday punch, and he certainly proved us correct. Well, now it's probably his Saturday night punch. <laughs> and you just wonder how far this young man uh, goes. A good amateur background. Well, with this kind of support, this kind of support, he's going to be a... Uh, a staple up, uh, up in the central New York area, I think. All right, let's go for the time of the stoppage. Here's Joe Antonacci. One minute and 24 seconds of round number one. Your winner by technical knockout in his professional debut from Utica. New York, Derek Superbad Evans. Derek Evans, ladies and gentlemen, how does it feel? How does your first pro fight feel? Oh man, it was amazing. I trained hard for this. I ain't here come here for nothing. Sounds like a lot of other people came here with you. How does the fan support feel? I brought, I brought all the people I love with me, all my family, all my friends. I love y'all. That was for y'all. There's more to come. All right. Well, I got a feeling you're gonna be back here at Turning Stone soon. Congratulations, Derek Evans, ladies and gentlemen.
Evans. Right. Derek Evans, uh, he showed it. And plus, he brings, uh, especially here in this area, he brings, uh, Steph, to answer a good question, uh, he's back at Turning Stone, but with all the other outlying areas in this region, any promoters going to want him on their show because of the... Uh, the ticket sales that he'll bring in just him alone. He brings a whole new level of excitement into that ring with his fan base. The fans love him, and at least for tonight, he lived up to that nickname, Superman. <laughs>